Right, Alicia, and welcome. Happy day. Hillary Clinton, she is a way over there with regards to being a left-wing commie person. I mean, it is unbelievable all the things that she wants to do. She believes that we are too dumb to look after ourselves and the government's got to come in and do that for us. And her camp now is saying that we're even too stupid to raise our own children and the village needs to do that. The village? I mean, only a village idiot would talk like that. I mean, leave us alone. Are you really one? wanted to come into all of the schools and raise our kids. Uh, they want to have a national program for health care, daycare, pardon me, they're talking about both, I guess. And then again, it's just inappropriate. I mean, that shouldn't even be constitutional. That's redistribution of mind and thinking. They're already past the money and property part. Now they're trying to get into our brains. Politicians, you know what? They should all have an expiry date. I recognize that the presidency does, but I think it should be throughout the entire system and also with bureaucrats. You're expired now. Go away because you're sour. And we want somebody new in here that ain't so sour, don't you know? People say and do evil and vile things online. The online kind of world that we're in today has brought out a whole new thing with people. It's amazing. Recently, I was with a four-year-old child that was doing some things online I, and trying to, you know, entertain him, right? And, and so I showed him some cartoons and some of the words, that, you know, the comments on cartoons, it's shocking. As Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, you should see what people do. Is this kids? Is this big people doing it? I don't know. Wow, uh, there's a lot of loose screws out there, and uh, what are we going to do? I, I mean, I get the part about free speech, but, but, but you also have to kind of watch out for crazy. How do you fix stupid? I mean, I used to say that you could just vote it out of office, but it's past the political point now. There's so many people that are doing so many things, and typically a liberal always calls people names when you run out of facts because they'll let a fact get in your way, but I almost think now it's past that in the sense that you got all the crazies coming online. Am I making any sense to you? I wanted just to share that with you because you know what? Uh, it's filth from your own property, and, and, and by that, remark I mean that if you have a blog or a website and some idiot is on there saying bad filthy things take it off I mean that is your right to do because he's trying to influence things people on the right like me I'm okay my thin is thick and I'm old and I don't know any better but a lot of people like me if they have an opinion to share and they do it online and some liberal comes on and says evil filthy things they get frightened they take their blog down and they go home because they're scared to be themselves right because it's too painful somebody just called me a bad name and i'm sensitive the liberal people aren't as sensitive that's not quite right they kind of are because they're bullies they can give it but they can't take it a whole bunch of share in there did you get any of that write it down hey alberta canada you got the ndp government there they're communist people they too think that you people are dumb, we're gonna look after you, and recently they came up with a carbon tax, and we're gonna do a carbon tax. Are you kidding me? Really? Just the Calgary School Board alone now this year has to pay an additional $300,000 to bust their kids to school because of the carbon tax. None of it makes any sense, but to make you feel good, the Calgary government has spent $5 million of taxpayers' money in a depression kind of period going on in Alberta to tell you that it's good. They're educating you, they're brainwashing you, $5 million of your money to tell you that what we're doing to screw you even more is okay. <laughs> is that right? It ain't right politically and it certainly ain't right ethically. They walk among us left wing wackles. Hey, vote right next time, don't you know? And come on back here. Well, more for you too from the right. See ya.